वेलकम अगेन इन योर चैनल मैथ पुंज इन दिस वीडियो वी विल इंट्रोड्यूस अबाउट ज्योमेट्री व्हाट इज ज्योमेट्री ज्योमेट्री इज द ब्रांच ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स वेयर वी डील विद शेप एंड फिगर्स एंड एंड वी मेजर देम कंपेयर विद अदर फिगर एंड स्टडी द प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ शेप एंड फिगर दिस इज ज्योमेट्री इंट्रोडक्शन अबाउट द ज्योमेट्री the basic concept start from the point what is point point is a mark of position it is used to represent the position it has no length no breadth no height and it is denoted by using any alphabet of english here you can name it like alphabet a if any point located is here you can name it like point p maybe the point can be here you can name it like r so this is a p r r the point our next topic is line what is line line has no end point because there is a end point one is here and one is here but line has no end point so it can be extend in both direction maybe this direction and maybe this right direction so we can extend in both direction it is called line because extended in endless length so it has no definite length line also denoted in a sort this direction and because the line made with the infinite points we can name it like a and b two point here this is the line ab if we write here like p and q then we can write like line pq and the indication for the line is this both directions ray if we want to show in a without point so we can name it like line l indication always we use small l or a small letter because we use capital letter for the indication of the point and the small letter if we write here like m small m we will write here for the indication of the line m next topic is line segment what is line segment line segment is a part of a line because line has a endless direction but segment has a end point a line segment has two end point always it can be obtained joining two points also if there is a two point and we will join these two point indication of the point we use always capital letter so a and b when we join this joining two point also is a line segment it is definite length also so we can measure line segment it is p and q it is the line segment p and q and we can measure the distance between p and q we can measure a to b it can be 5 cm and so on and the line segment the indication is that indicating just like this so ab is line segment denoted by using symbol is it is ab and ab is line segment like this this is pq pq is a line segment so here we can draw like this way in a line segment it was a two end point but what if there is a one end point this is one end point and ray is going endless so this is called ray so ray has a only one end point and endless direction so indication of the ray we start from the end point a and the second point may be here b third point may be here c so indication for the ray the denotation of the ray is like this so ab is the ray this is the ab ab also ray because starting from the a we can indicate here also same way ac also can be a ray ac because this is end point a and the direction to the c but we cannot say bc is a ray bc is not a ray because b is not a end point of that ray so it is 
not indication ray as a like this middle point so always be careful for indication of the ray the end point should be definite shown here like ac now consider what is angle angle is like a, this is the ray this is end point this is a ray when two ray having a common end point this is the ray first ray is like a and b this is the first ray and second ray if there is a common end point second ray is like this it is also the end point this is a a there and d a d is other ray so these two are common end point then we can draw here like a way this is the a end point and this is the ray d so what we say here it is form an angle the common end point of two ray is form angle so here a b is the ray and a d is the ray and the common end point it means the union so it called the union so union of the ray a b and ray a d is form an angle so writing the angle always we use vertex in a middle so it is angle the indication of the writing angle is that b a d that is b a d we can write this way otherwise always a should be in a middle term so we start from the d also d a b we can write here d a b angle also because this is the union part of the two ray what will happen when the two ray intersect each other this is the two ray a b and a d the ray is intersection point is here so only intersection of this is called a point so only point a this is the point only so intersection of the two ray is the point and union of the two ray is form angle now your exercise is match the following what is line 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 has no end point endless direction so it is a here what is ray ray has one end point so there is a one end point this is the ray what is line segment it is definite measurement so it has both end point so what is both end point this is two end point so this is line segment what is angle angle has a common end point of a ray so angle has a common end point of ray and what is point point has no length no breadth so this is e that's all so thank you for watching this video and requesting you please support and subscribe and share to maximum and maximum to your friend and if any doubt please message i can solve your any doubt till then thank you